Oh my god and another sad news. We are deeply saddened to inform you that Cuban film and television actor Enrique Molina died on September 3rd. Enrique Molina's cause of death has been confirmed after his death. The CMHW announced the sad news this morning, writing, Another strong blow is suffered by Cuban culture. Another goodbye must be given, this time, to one of the greats on the screen. Condolences to family, friends, and the people of Cuba in general. Molina, who has been fighting COVID-19 for several days, was one of the most popular artists among the Cuban people. His son, Pavel Molina Ruiz, shared a photo of his parents cradling each other on his Facebook page and wrote, You got what you wanted so bad, daddy. Now for, kiss her a million times and tell her how much I miss her. How we all miss you. Love yourselves in eternity. I am happy for you, the greatest example of love in the world, Pavel Molina Ruiz added. Enrique Molina was born on October 31, 1943, in Santiago de Cuba. He joined the Conjunto Dramatico de Orient Theatrical Company in 1968. In 1968, Molina began to work in television and appeared on Telerebold until 1970, when he moved to Havana. After moving to Havana, Molina continued to develop his talent in television series and soap operas such as the popular Tierra Brava. Over time, Molina became one of the most versatile actors in Cuba. The Horn of Plenty actor also had performed theater and starred in Cuban radio and television programs and in films. In 2015, the star received the honorary title of the first edition of the Enrique Almirante Award. Enrique Molina's cause of death at the age of 77 was reportedly related to COVID-19. According to reports, the actor has been fighting COVID-19 for several days, but unfortunately, he lost the battle. Please subscribe my channel and post comments. God bless you. Thanks.